Hey guys, Element here from the 82nd Marine Regiment. In this video, we're going to go over how to install our mods. We use Arma 3 Sync to be able to control updates and provide mods that may not be on Workshop. Now, Arma 3 Sync doubles down as a launcher to start your game with as well, if you wish. Now, first step is we're going to download Arma 3 Sync, which can be found via the link to Armaholic in the description of the video or on the forum thread. Now, in this case, I already have it open. Page is going to look like this. Scroll down to the bottom. Click to download Arma 3 Sync. In this case, I already have it downloaded. We're going to go start it up here. Hit the XE, install it. It might uh, prompt you for Java, either when you install or once you try to start it. If it does that, you just install Java and you're good to go. Now, the second step is we're going to go and start Arma 3 Sync. This is my Arma 3 Sync. The first step you want to do is navigate to the folder of Arma 3 directory. You can do this easily via Steam. Going to Properties, Local Files, Browse Local Files, and it will go straight to it. Create a folder in here. In my case, it's called 82nd MR. You can also name it whatever you want, as long as you don't accidentally uh, delete it and you know where, what it is. Once you've done that, you can hit the X and go back to Arma 3 Sync. Now, in this case, my Arma 3 Sync is already set up. In your case, it may not be the case. And what you want to do is you want to go to Edit under Profiles, make a new profile. In my case, I'm going to call it Test. You may call it 82nd MR or whatever you wish. You're going to select it. It's going to go empty. Make sure it's always selected when you get on. Go to Add on Options, Big Blue Plus, and show it where the new folder is that you just created. In my case, it's not in this folder. Uh, <laughs> it's over here. And Steam Apps, common. Oh, common. Common. Arma 3. When you click three times and it fucks you over, that's my folder. You hit open. Make sure that's correct. In this case, it sees all my add ons, uh, but it won't see for you. Go to Launcher Options. If you have a profile or you're planning to use a profile, select it and select the profile. In this case, it's Private Album. If you are experienced slow starts, you can select no splash screen and default world empty. As well, if you notice small lags, you can turn up no turn no logs. I, as a mission developer, need the logs. Then you go to select down here, and it will open up your Arma 3. If it does not, then find your directory and select Arma 3 underscore x64. Hit open, and it will be selected. Now go to repositories. In the description of the video, you can find the auto config URL, or you may find it uh, in the Steam uh, the forum post. Sorry about that. Uh, go to the blue plus. In my case, I have it in a notepad right here. Copy it. Paste it into public auto config, config URL and hit import. It will then pick up all the info here, and then you hit OK. In my case, it's gonna it's already there. Now you want to select the notify button so that it notifies you when you start up the program. Then you want to hit this blue arrow. You love it when we get Steam messages, right? In my case, all the mods are here. Make sure the default destination folder is correct by just reading it. Don't click on it as it will screw up. Then hit select all. It will select all the mods. These will be red for you. There's an optional mods folder down the bottom. You do not have to download it and you can click the plus to see what's inside of it. You want to then go to settings, make sure the maximum number of connections is 10 to provide the fastest download speed. And hit the start button and it would finish. Once it's finished, it will check the files. In this case, it's fast for me because I already have it. Hit the X, go back to add-ons. And this is how you start your game with the mod set. Go to mod sets, wait for it to synchronize. Select the 82nd Marine Regiment repo. Hit OK. You can see all the mods here. They can also be found on this side. You can drag and drop over, and you check mark this one and hit start game and you're good to go. If you wish to create your own folders, you can do this by right clicking here, click add group, name it, and then you can just drag mods and start it. And that's how our 3 sync works and that's how you get your mods. Stay safe out there Marines and good luck on the battlefield.